Okay, so tell, tell me about the users of this. Is it technical project managers that set this up? Is it like their Salesforce admin type that sets it up? Or can the salesperson set this up, you think? Yeah, sales salesperson can do it because it's simple enough. But it depends on the organization, uh, the, the company's workflow. Maybe they will only give the permission here, edit the permission to the sales manager or someone they can edit it or someone they cannot edit it or someone they can only update or read it. Back to the question you asked me about the automation. It's also yeah. very easy. You can just new automation and then you can see a trigger. What trigger? If anyone submit a form, then what you want to do here, you can see them. I want to send a message to Slack or here you need to, you need to put the web pool URL from the Slack and then what you want to write here. Someone submitted a list. Please check it, the name, the phone number, the email, and then uh, detail or more details. And then you can put the, the field here, the name, the form. So then you can choose your variable from yeah, the yeah. call. And even the link here, you can see the URL, record URL. When mm. he, he click the URL, it will expand the, the call to see the detail. Then just save. So I think it's simple. And also another automation is you can do it like this. For example, send an email. When someone, they just send, submit a message, the, the client or the, the prospect submit a form. You can write an email, let him know you, we, you have successfully submitted. And then you can book a calendar, put, schedule mm -hmm. a call to me and put your calendar here, something like this one. Yeah. And also put a video, you can put a video here. Before he schedule a ca uh, calendar, with a scale call with you, you can ask him to see the video. And then the video would be just a URL to a video? Uh, you can put YouTube video here. Mm, got it. I think it's a URL something. Oh. Yeah, yeah, the link to the, yeah. to the video. Because okay. this, uh, this one is a markdown format. The markdown format. Okay. So as long as you send this workflow, I think the, the sales, you can scale it. You can put your form everywhere and let the people to submit it or put it on the YouTube apps or any place. Okay. So I think uh, this part can, can help you to solve the, the problem the last time you asked me. You don't need to manually record it down. Yeah. Got it.